I am not aware of that. But if they are delinquent in their taxes, there should be a penalty that everybody would have to pay. In this case, if you look at the new piece of tax legislation, it would say that the, anybody who is a manager, director, finance officer, if it is true, if it is true that any entity is not paying its taxes, they should be held accountable. Plain and simple. There's no if ands or buts about that. You don't recall that it was ever brought to the house for any of those taxes to be wiped out so that they could pay their dividends while you were... I, I, I'm, I'm not aware because of that. That's the case that someone is making, that it may not be they owe those 30 million, but... I don't remember that ever coming to the Senate. But if it were the case as the state-owned company, it, it shouldn't be made a case no, that because no. that's a state-owned company, you're not supposed it's, to, or you know, necessarily have to... It's not a state-owned company. The government just happens to have the most shares in it, but it's not a state-owned company. It's a private company. But even so, it doesn't matter. Anybody who is liable to pay taxes should pay the taxes, and there should be penalties um, affixed to anybody who purposely avoids taxes that they should pay. It doesn't matter who you are. If you owe your taxes, you need to pay your taxes like everybody else.